So this question looks like a simplify question, right? It qualifies for that strategy because it is short. Simplify questions are typically one to three lines long and it contains an equation. Simplified questions will typically contain an equation or an expression. So what does that mean for me? Before I even really read the question, I'm gonna take this to a x minus 15 equals three x plus five plus five x minus one, and I'm gonna simplify it. So I have two a x minus 15, there's nothing to simplify there, equals, but now I can distribute the three across here. So I get three x plus 15, I can distribute the five across here. So I get plus five x minus five. I have like terms, three x and five x, which gives me an eight x. And then I have a 15 minus five, which gives me a positive 10. And again, I have my two a x minus 15 here. All right, so the question says in the equation above, a is a constant. If no value of x satisfies the equation, if no value of x satisfies the equation, what is the value of a? All right, so let's think about well, what does it mean when we read if no value of x satisfies the equation? So usually what that means is, right, well, it's pretty straightforward, right? There isn't any number that you can plug in for x that will make this equation true. There's some a value that we can plug in that would then create a situation in which we cannot solve for x. Now, the best way for us to do that would be to actually make this 8x. And here's why. If, I, if that term is 8x, I'd be left with 8x minus 15 equals 8x plus 10. And that can never work. There's no x value, right, that would ever make that scenario true. There's no x value that'll ever make that true because we're subtracting 15 on this side and we're adding 10 to whatever this answer is after, after substituting x in, right? We're subtracting 15 here, we're adding 10 here. There's no way that these two things can ever be equal. So I'm gonna say, hey, I want 2ax to equal 8x. I guess I could have just said 2a to equal 8. And if that's the case, that means that a would equal 4, and my solution here is choice C.